Howdy folks and welcome back to Pool School. In today's episode, I am going to do, as promised, a product review, one of three. This first product I'm going to be reviewing is a pool brush. It is made by a company called ProTuff, and this is one of the best pool brushes I've ever seen. And the coolest thing, lifetime replacement warranty. So what do you say we dive right in? Alrighty folks, before we get started, I want to thank you once again for watching this video, remind you to like it if you do, subscribe to my channel if you've not done so already, and please share my channel with everyone you know who owns a pool. Also, don't forget to check out my membership website, PoolSchooler.com, it'll come across the screen right here, PoolSchooler.com. It is full of more exclusive members only content that will help you save even more money servicing your pool yourself. Alrighty folks, so being in the pool service industry for the last 20 plus years, I've used a lot of different products, a lot of different pool tools and stuff like that. I've obviously used a lot of different brushes. Um, some have been better than others. All of them wear out over time. Um, I got to a place where I didn't want to spend a lot of money on a expensive brush. So I ended up buying a brush on Amazon for 19 bucks and it lasted about the same as the other ones that I've bought. So I figured what the heck, I'm going to get one of those and just use those from now on. However, I decided to look into a company called ProTuff and they actually, the first thing I bought from them was a net. And one of the things that impressed me the most about their, uh, their products was two things. Number one, lifetime replacement warranty. So if, if it wears out, they'll either replace it or there's parts that can be replaced if they break on the, on the, on the products and they will replace those for you absolutely free. And um, that's pretty cool. Uh, it's kind of hard to beat that. If you're a pool service professional, they give you a 50% discount on those replacement parts or the replacement product itself. So that's even better because us pool professionals, we're pretty abusive to our pool tools. So we tend to go through those a little more often. But the second reason was they also donate a portion of their profits to the Gary Sinise Foundation. And that is for um, wounded warriors and first responders. And it's one of the most fantastic organizations I've ever heard of. And they help our first responders and military personnel. Um, and that's just a fantastic cause. So anyway, that's one of the biggest reasons I'm such a fan of this product and their products, ProTuff. As I said, we're gonna talk about their brush today. Okay, so this is the box that the brush comes in. And um, when you first get it, it comes like this, straight across. And you'll notice that it's got these really sturdy bristles. I, I, again, I'm kind of a, I'm kind of uh, skeptical, or I've been skeptical in the past over bristles that nylon bristles only, because they don't tend to hold up very well and they're also very flimsy, which is why I typically would use a combo brush. But these bristles are actually quite thick, a lot thicker as far as the gauge of the, the, the nylon fibers that they use and a lot more sturdy and stiffer. I think these are gonna hold up pretty darn good, including in the Arizona sun. Uh, the other thing is, you'll notice it doesn't have those curved ends on it right away, okay? It comes with these two ends that look like this. They're curved and they fit on the side of the brush, each side like this, okay? And there, there's a really cool mechanism to do it. You see that little tab right there, that little, that little thing, it's, it's magnetic. And you'll see in there, there's a hole. If you wanna add these on, and I actually was never a fan of using this kind of stuff on a, on a brush, and I didn't like the brushes that have these curved ends because I felt like they were just, for the, for the amount of benefit that they gave you, they were just too hard to move through the water. However, I have since changed my tune because I found that these actually help a couple things. Number one, they help save wear and tear on the edge, the side of that um, brush. When you're going up against the sides of the pool or steps, that edge is gonna rub against the, the, the surface and it's gonna wear that off really fast and it's gonna eventually destroy your brush. So this actually protects against that. Plus, when you do go across steps, it actually catches the steps as it goes and it gets those edges and corners really nice where the wall comes down like this and then it turns like this. It gets that edge right there really nicely. The other thing I noticed is it actually doesn't restrict the movement of the through the water that much. So it's something I took a little getting used to, but I have no problem with it now. And I actually enjoy having these on there more. So I'm going to show you how these go on. I got to set my phone down so you can see it. Okay, so this is the brush and this is one of the ends. And again, like I said, they come with them detached. You'll notice there's a hole right there. And you'll notice that's the little magnetic tab. And it's got a little button right there. Really simple to do. You just take it on each end of the brush, slide it in, okay? Push it all the way in. And you hear what it clicked? It actually, because of the magnet, it clicks all the way in. If it doesn't, you can just push it down and that locks it in place. And it's that simple. 
if you want to remove them, there is a little piece like this. It slides up like this. And what you do is you use it inside the bristles. There's a hole there right in here. You push this into it and, you, and it will depress this, push it out, and you just slide it right out. And so this little tool, there's one on each of the ends. So there's one on this one and there's one on this one. And again, they fit perfectly into it. I'll show you what it looks like. Fits perfectly right in here, slides in the slot, clicks into place and I've not lose, lost one yet, so we're in good shape. So I'm gonna put this one in. Uh, the other thing is you gotta make sure that this piece right here is sticking out, okay? If it's in, then it's gonna get in the way. See that gets in the way there? That little piece of it is in the way. You wanna make sure that that's flush this way and just turn it upside down like this. It makes it really easy. Slide it on the end. And then again, this one didn't lock into place, so I push it down, clicks, and we're good to go, all right? now. I'm going to show you the feature of this brush that I absolutely love the most. And it literally, in my opinion, it's the best thing since sliced bread when it comes to convenience and efficiency and ease of operation. So here we go. But I'm going to take you to a pool and we're going to look at it. Okay, folks. So as promised, here is the feature that I think is absolutely one of the best things that has ever been made for a pool brush or a pool net for that matter. And it is this piece right here. This is basically a quick release, quick insert pole attachment that goes on the end of the brush. When you get your brush, again, it doesn't come with the ends attached. You have to attach those if you want to. And I am using those now because I do like them. And, it, and also, it comes with this feature right here. This thing is not attached. It's really simple to attach. It's just these two pieces right here, these two little uh, easy clip. You just pinch it, slide it on this. I might have to let go for a second with my phone, but oh, look at that, one hand. Right in, it slips in and it clicks in and it's locked in place, okay? The thing I like about this is that it makes it so easy to put this end of your brush into your pole. And that's super important because for me, I've, I don't know if you've ever noticed, when you have just the easy clips where you have to pinch here and then just kind of fit it into the end of the pole, like it would be on a net like this. And again, this is the ProTef net, more on, an, on a review on this one later, but they've actually changed this, this um, format of this particular net to include this quick release thing. It's really hard sometimes, especially when a pole is a little thicker inside and in less room, less free play, to pinch these and get those out. I don't know about you, but I've pinched my fingers numerous times to where it leaves blood blisters, or when I'm sliding the pole in and out, or the, the net or brush in and out of the pole, I pinch my, my loose skin here, my little flap of skin in there, and it hurts like heck, and sometimes it'll cut me, but this makes it super easy. I'm gonna show you how easy it is to do. Watch this. Okay, just as a demonstration, I want to show you, again, if you just have the easy clips, and this is the ProTuff net, but they have upgraded it so that now it has the same quick release feature as the brush. Sometimes it pinches out, it, it kind of gets stuck in like, ah, and there, it's really tight. And again, their pole, more on that in another product review, is a little bit thicker, and so there's less tolerance inside the end of the pole for the tool to fit into, which means you really got to pinch this. Some poles are looser, and again, think, well, I want a looser pole. Well, the more free play you have in there, the faster you're going to wear out these clips. So again, I want you to see how easy it is for this thing to go in, okay? I just pinch these two. So this is the part that locks it into place, these two. And this is the part that I pinch. And notice my fingers stay completely away, and my hand does, from the end of the pole. In, and it's just like that, just like that, okay? Pinch these, slides in, and that easy. And to take it out, pinch these, and out it comes. It's so much easier than fighting the easy clips to try to do it just via the clips. So this, again, is a feature that I absolutely love. And the cool thing about it, again, is you know, what if it wears out? Because easy clips wear out. Again, like I said, this is one unit. This pops out, and you can have that, again, free lifetime replacements. This will be replaced for free if and when these wear out, okay? And again, it's so easy to put back in. Just like that. Pinch it, slide it in the pole and you're up and running. I love this feature so much. All right, so how does the brush perform? Rather than bore you with a long video or watching me brush the pool down, I can tell you this. Remember what I said earlier? I was concerned about these, those, those curved edges on the brush creating way too much drag and resistance as you move the brush through the water. To tell you the truth, the amount of additional resistance is negligible, especially if you have a pole that is a little bit heavier. If you have these super, super ultralight poles, you might have to push a little harder. Um, I'm using their ProTuff pole, which is a little heavier, and it's a lot more durable. More on that again in another product review. 
Um, but it actually doesn't really matter as far as the drag. It doesn't increase it so much that I notice it. In fact, I've been using it with the ends on for the last several weeks and I really can't notice a difference anymore. It is very thorough. The brush moves through the pool very easily. Um, and it also stays on contact with the pool sides pretty well. And again, with that little lift on the edge, the little 90 degree bends, when you go past um, the step, it catches the side of the step for you. So I don't have to go back and forth and back and forth to get the edge of the step. So it's a win-win for me. So the brush moves through the pool very well. And uh, again, I'm gonna give you now my overall rating on what I think of this product. Alrighty folks, so here is my verdict, preliminary, on the Pro Tough pool brush. Now remember, I've used this product now for about a month and a half at the making of this video, and I'm going to do a follow-up review because I tend to like to use the product for a long period of time before I give it a final analysis or final review. I'll do that in a year, but my preliminary analysis of this product and my grade is an A+. I know, it's like, wow, really an A+, after a month and a half? Yes, and here's why. A couple reasons, number one, Lifetime unlimited free replacement warranty. How do you beat that? And for the price, this brush is about the same price as any of the upper level pool brushes that I've seen online. So it's comparable in price, but again, with the unlimited lifetime replacement warranty, it's kind of hard to beat that. Also, that quick release and, and insert sleeve on the neck of the brush is honestly makes it so easy to use. I cannot tell you how much I like that feature on this brush and that makes it easier to use. Also, that you don't have to use the little ends on it. You can actually take those off or put them on so you can configure it how you want. I find that I do like the ends on it, which I didn't think I was going to, but I do like them and it doesn't really make the pool brush harder to move through the pool. It's pretty negligible, but it also makes you a little more efficient in when you use the brush. You don't have to, you don't have to brush quite as much or make as many strokes with the brush to get the same effect uh, so it's more efficient. So that is why I would give it an A plus in the beginning and uh, and in a year I'm going to revisit this and we'll do a final review after it's been used and hopefully not too much abused by me. So folks that is my preliminary review of the Pro Tough pool brush. I hope it made sense. If you have any questions or comments you can leave them in the comment section below this video or you can email me directly. My email address is going to come across the bottom of the screen right here. It is kennypoolschool at gmail.com. Once again, kennypoolschool at gmail.com. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And check out my membership website, poolschooler.com. And until we meet again, remember to have fun, be safe, and always watch those kids and elderly folk and pets around water. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.